Yes, the Lilo is still in the back. Oh, Tally, shut up. Oh, this is a big jump. Tally hoes, guess what? Why am I shouting? I don't know. I've got my phone call with my surgeon tomorrow. I'm nervous. The last four months have been the hardest but most rewarding months ever. This is my first body positive newspaper article. Whoa! Oh my god, that is so cute. Oh, a young teenage love couple. Oh, they're so cute. They were so excited to see each other. They were like running towards each other. That makes me think of the good old days. Being 17 and in love, the best feeling in the world. Anyway, hi Tally Hoes, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Yes. The Lilo is still in the back. It's going to remain there. <laughs> Welcome back to a new vlog. I'm very, very happy. I'm very excited. Life is really great. We are coming to the end of the heat wave here in the UK. Hence why the Lilo is still fully in action because it's been used a lot recently. Just been going to the beach and stuff. So I've got like some makeup on today. Pretty much just the eyes. I've got some concealer on because... Um, I am outside of a new clinic that I've never tried before. It's called St. George's Clinic here in Brighton and Hove, right pretty much like five minutes right off the motorway. So if you do come down, it's really easy to find. I'm going to have laser hair removal on my face, my underarms, my stomach and my thighs, I believe, but I'm not 100% sure. I'm going to film that for you guys. I am also filming another video, which we, which you will see in a couple of months <laughs> i'm not going to tell you what it is but it's going to have the same intro as this because it's the same day or it's the start of this day anyway i forgot a drink so hopefully ah there's a post office there amazing after this i need to go shopping because I, I haven't been shopping in like at least a week and a half i've got no food in the house it's a bit of an issue <laughs> Anyway, let's go into my appointment and then after that, I'll probably show you what I got, what, what I guys got you, <laughs> what I got you guys from, what I got, what am I saying? What I got from Audi for you guys, because apparently it inspires some of you guys on your weekly shop. So if I could inspire you, then I'm just going to keep on doing it. I really want a dog, but anyway, let's go. Tally hose. if you've not tried this drink, what are you doing? It's Robinson squash, but it's a drink. Oh, Tally, shut up. You just need to try this, okay? It's only one pound as well, bargain. Okay, I'm here. It's been some ultra gel, ultra sound gel. Okay. Onto the skin, and that's purely just so that the machine glides. Okay. okay. Would you like me to take my earrings out? No, that's not going to be a problem. Okay. This is a, a concentrated area. Okay, so I'm just going to do a little section. How's that feel? Yeah, fine. Okay. It's weird, it's hot and cold at the same time. Yeah. <laughs> Hello Talios. So I just had my treatment done and I'm very very happy getting back into laser hair removal on my face but apparently if my hormones are not in the like right place then the hair is going to be more stubborn and it will result in it not working as well. Two hours later. Talios, guess what? Why am I shouting? I don't know. But I got four Aldi yogurts, and the best part is that 
my mum went to Lidl and she found the Lidl version of the protein yogurts you guys know I've been trying to get my hands on these yogurts for a long time and I am very very excited breakfast is back in action tally hoes because I don't really like too much for breakfast I also like something sweet for breakfast so the yogurts are kind of perfect I get a good hit of protein as well so I'm so heavy I'm so heavy oh, hello I'm in so much traffic right now coming out of Aldi going back home that was pretty much the only thing I got oh I got a cushion which I'll show you when I get home but there was only one I still got it because it's so cute and it definitely needs a little bit of a wash but I'm obsessed with the red Thai uh, salmon fillets from Aldi as well they're so banging I was just in the tunnel we're coming out now but aside from that I don't think there's any point me showing you what I got and that was all I had to say really so um <laughs> see you soon oh my pup is just undone literally as soon as I press record so I've taken myself on a little date we've come to Costa we've got a skinny frappe with skimmed milk and skinny salted caramel it's really good actually it's not even a date because i'm actually here to send loads of emails i thought get out the house tally and you might be a little bit more productive do you know what i mean so i'm gonna send these really quick it's not gonna be a long trip because all of my shopping's in the car but i've got some important emails to get through once i've done that go home and chill this is so yummy Honestly, someone just complimented my jeans. I would show you my outfit, but there's like no one in here now. Um, but she was like, oh, where are they from? I said, Fashion Over Curve, as always. <laughs> Literally, my whole outfit's Fashion Over Curve at this point. Oh, there's also some coffee in here, which is probably going to keep me up all night. Yay. I've got my phone call with my surgeon tomorrow. I'm nervous. But I'm gonna be vlogging tomorrow, so I will let you know how it goes, of course. So, here she is. How cute is she? But they only had one. I'm so upset about it. But she's really cute, so I had to get her. If she's just on her own on the sofa, you know, maybe I'll get a round one to match or we'll try and find something very similar. But yeah, go to your Audi, see if you can get your hands on these. It's so nice. I really like it. It's like Bohemia vibes, you know? Okay, I'm just gonna put away the shopping and I will probably see you tomorrow. Oh my God, I look awful. Tally hoes, I just wanted to come on here quickly. I'm going to the kitchen because it's the best lighting. I just got off my phone call with Mr. Awad. Oh. And honestly, I just love talking to him. I just think he's incredible. And he just makes me feel so good. So everything is going perfectly. He's really, really happy with my progress. <laughs> and I'm just really, really happy, you know, like the last three months, four months, is it? Wait, May, June, July, August. Four months have been the hardest, but most rewarding months ever. And to hear that I'm still doing amazingly you know i caught up with him about how much i've lost he said that's exactly where you're meant to be right now i'm really really happy with that and literally i just need to up some protein <laughs> although last night tally hose i drank my protein shake way too quickly it's almost as if i forgot i had the surgery and i threw up <laughs> tmi sorry but i'm just on a high right now I feel a bit emotional. <laughs> I'm just so happy. Like, you know, this is the one person whose opinion matters most. And I'm just so over the moon. <laughs> anyway, um, I've got, I've just been working today, just been editing um, some videos for you guys and stuff like that. Now I'm gonna go on a really long walk. I'm not gonna take any technology, which is kind of what I've been doing 
most days. I just like to leave my phone at home or to take it but put it on like airplane mode after I've downloaded a podcast and just have some me time. So that's what I'm gonna do. I was gonna go to the gym today but I'm so achy from, yes from the day before yesterday that I didn't. I'm so happy. <laughs> Wow, that's so incredible. You know what? It's just the nicest thing to hear from the person that, y that I value the most, which is my surgeon. You know, so many people can have an input in how they think you're doing or how fast they think you're losing or all of these things, but it doesn't matter. What matters is you and your program, your surgeon, what you're doing and how proud of yourself you are. And I'm so proud of myself because it's been hard. And just to hear it, it's just great. Anyway, I'm gonna leave you guys. <laughs> but uh, I'll probably catch up with you guys tomorrow because we're off to the gym. No, we're not, tomorrow's Wednesday. What are we doing tomorrow? Oh yeah, something I can't tell you, but something very exciting. But I will probably take you guys to the gym with me at some point this week. Okay, ciao. They're gonna get bored of us. We do the same thing in every video. We're just at the gym and I'm sweating a lot. on reps. Wow, well, this is a big jump. Get a personal trainer, they do everything for you, including getting your weight and putting away your weight. Luxury treatment. You're killing me. Well, killing yourself because you've Shall I move the camera? Hello, it's been about half an hour. I drove all the way home. I was literally down my road. And then mum said, can you come with me to the, to the opticians and help me pick some sunglasses. Oh, some sunglasses. Oh my God, I can't talk. Or some glasses. And so I'm now walking to meet her because she had left, I had left and yeah, I'm hungry, I'm thirsty, and it's a nice hot day. I kind of thought that we were gonna go to the beach or something, but apparently not. There's loads of people here. I haven't vlogged in public in a long time and I'm feeling very orcs. But anyway, so that's pretty much the update of the day. There's not really much to vlog about in my life currently. I much prefer the travel ones. <laughs> Hello, good morning there. How are we doing? So today is Friday. You guys are watching this on Sunday. Yesterday was hectic, okay? After I vlogged a little bit, me and mum went to the opticians and then I had a phone interview with The Sun to be in tomorrow's, Saturday's article. So 
Tomorrow we're gonna go and get that from the shop. I'm so excited. This is my first body positive newspaper article. So I'm very, very, very excited. It was such a pleasure to work with The Sun. They were absolutely amazing. It's the fab section, by the way. Shout out to Joel and Yasmin. And then after that phone call, I had a lot of other exciting things, which you will know about very, very soon. It's been a lot. Last night was very intense, very overwhelming, but so exciting at the same time. I did cry yesterday. The girls that get it, get it. And the girls who don't, don't. Me and mum are off to do a few errands, which I also can't tell you about because it all links to the same thing. But I will probably catch up with you guys tomorrow when I go and pick up the paper. It will also be online for you guys to check out as well. I'll leave that down in the description bar or the comments so you can go and have a little read of that. Should have mentioned tally hose in that. Just realised. Sorry, Tellios, next time I will. Good morning. I'm in the exact same position I think I ended the vlog yesterday in. Well, it's early, it's half past eight. I've been up since half past six. Ugh, I'm just too eager, but I wanted to vlog before my niece gets to work. I don't know what time she starts work, but they've credited her. So I'm gonna try and ask her to get a newspaper before she goes into work. My niece is only 17 and she's been credited as a photographer in this. So I'm just really happy. By the way, I have not done my hair, I've only done a bit of my makeup, but I have a feeling Welcome to she's the already at work. Day. That was a fail, but we're gonna try and ring her later. For now, I'm gonna finish getting ready and then me and mum are gonna go get the paper. Me and mum are in the car. We just saw someone, well, we're dropping something off at someone's house and we saw one of her neighbors had the papers in her hand. She had the Daily Mail, not the Sun, but she might have had the Sun behind it because she had two. I'm just thinking, oh my God, that's really weird. Like everyone's going to be, everyone who reads the paper, which I felt like it wasn't a lot of people, but because she was young, it made me think maybe people do still read a lot of the mail. Well, obviously, otherwise it wouldn't still be going. But yeah, crazy. Because you can just read everything online now. But anyway, so yeah, we're in the car. We're just dropping something off. And then, sorry if you can hear the AC. It's quite hot in here. And then we're going to go to a petrol station and pick up a few coffees. We're here. Look. Why is it such a big paper? Where is it? Classy, trying to find it in a big... What if it's not even in here? Maybe it's in really small. This is taking forever. It's not in here, Mum. It's not in here. Mum. I do one page at a time. I just did. Maybe they're just trying to get me to buy it. But really, it's not in here. One eternity later. Yeah? <laughs> Whoa! I think I was gonna be in here. <laughs> okay, let's buy it. Just buy one now. No, I'm buying two. I'm buying three. No, you don't need what for? Because I want the three slices of paper. Okay. We looked for this for literally so long and it was huge. My whole picture is on the whole one side of the page. Okay, so it's been like an hour and a half. We went into Costa, I got a little drink, but obviously it takes me ages to drink it. Where is it? And it's literally melted. But what I ask for is salted caramel frappe, but with the sugar-free, I've told you this in this vlog already. Anyway, so I've just had the news that my niece has had her phone confiscated. So we are gonna ring my brother 
and hopefully he will let us talk to her. I'm gonna put her here so you guys can hear. Oh, hi. Hi. What are you up to? Um, can you get Mila, please? Mila! Mila! <laughs> Guess what? What? I'm in the news, uh, newspaper today. Newspaper? And they used one of your photos that you took of me and I asked them if they could put you in it. And they did. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm so proud. Look at us. Thank you. You're welcome. I love you. <laughs> I've sent you the pictures, but apparently your phone's confiscated. <laughs> yeah. Let me show you then. It's a really positive, amazing article. Because basically they were fat shaming on loose women. Um, and they basically wanted me to reply to it, and so I did. I just need to find it. It's not easy to find. Maybe I could just send you the picture, because it's going to take ages to find it. Love you, bye! I'm feeling emotional, but every time I look in the paper, I can't find it. That was actually really funny. I'm going to end this vlog here, because I want to go and edit it and get it up for you guys, so hopefully that you can go and buy your very own Sun newspaper and see it for yourself. The paper copy of this article is so, so, so powerful. I'm so so happy that i got to be part of this thank you to the sun again i've already said it but yeah so definitely try and get your hands on the actual copy but if you can't then i'll leave the link in the description thank you guys so much for continuing to support me and to watch my channel even the haters because bitch <laughs> i'll see you very soon for my next video i love you ciao also, if you struggle to find it just like me, it's on page 38 and 39.